Florence Welch. From Wikipedia, the free encyclopedia. Jump to navigation, jump to search. Florence Welch. Florence and the Machine 1209-2018-32, 32,800,000 768, cropped. JPG. Welch performing at KROQ Almost Acoustic Christmas in 2018. Born Florence Lentini Mary Welch. August 28, 1986, age 35. Camberwell, London, England. Citizenship. United Kingdom United States. Occupation. Singer-songwriter. Years active 2006 present. Musical career. Genres. Indie rock indie pop. Instruments vocals. Labels. Mashi Mashi I am Sound Island Universal Republic Republic Virgin M. Ipolator. Member of Florence and the Machine. Website FlorenceAndTheMachine.net. Florence Lantini Mary Welch 1, born August 28, 1986 3, is an English singer, the lead vocalist and primary songwriter of the indie rock band Florence and the Machine. The band's debut studio album, Lungs. 2009, topped the UK Albums Chart and won the Brit Award for Best British Album. Their next three albums also achieved chart success. In 2018, Welch released a book titled Useless Magic, a collection of lyrics and poems written by her, along with illustrations. Contents One Family and Early Life Two Career 2.1 2006 to 2010 Florence and the Machine and Lungs. 2.2 2011 to 12, Ceremonials and Solo Endeavors. 2.3 2015 to 21, Collaborations. 2.4 2022 present, Dance Fever. 3 Artistry. 3.1 Influences. 3.2 Image. 4 Personal Life. 5 Political Views. 6 Discography 6.1 As Featured Artist 6.1.1 Notes 6.2 Album Appearances 6.3 Songwriting Credits 7 Filmography 8 Awards and Nominations 9 References 10 External Links Family and Early Life Florence Lantini Mary Welch was born in Camberwell London on August 28, 1986 to parents Nick Russell Welch, an advertising executive for, and Evelyn Welch, née Samuels, an American immigrant from New York City for, who was educated at Harvard University and the Warburg Institute, University of London. 5-6, Evelyn is Professor of Renaissance Studies, Provost, and Senior Vice President, Arts and Sciences, at King's College London 7 and incoming Vice-Chancellor at the University of Bristol. Through her mother, Welch has both British and American citizenship. 8. Welch is the niece of satirist Craig Brown for, via Brown's wife and Welch's aunt, Frances Welch, 9, and granddaughter of Colin Welch, James Colin Ross Welch, former deputy editor of the Daily Telegraph and former Daily Mail parliamentary sketch writer, originally of Cambridgeshire. 9. Welch's maternal uncle is actor and director John Stockwell. 10. She also has a sister, Grace, who inspired Welch's song by the same name. 11. During her youth, Welch was encouraged by her Scottish paternal grandmother, Sybil Welch, knee Russell, 912, to pursue her performing and singing talents. 13. Welch's deceased grandmothers inspired numerous songs on Florence and the Machine's debut album Lungs. 14. In her youth, Welch also sang at family weddings and funerals. 15. Age 10, she performed the song of Yum Yum from the Mikado by Gilbert and Sullivan at Colin Welch's memorial service. 16. Welch's parents divorced when she was 13, and her mother eventually married their next-door neighbor. Professor Peter Openshaw. Around this time, her maternal grandmother, who had bipolar disorder, died by suicide. 17. 
in Florence and the Machine's 2018 single Hunger, she opened up for the first time about a teenage eating disorder. She has also spoken of being a highly imaginative and fearful child. I learned ways to manage that terror, drink, drugs, controlling food. 18. Welch was educated at Thomas's London Day School, Battersea 19, then went on to Allen School, South East London, where she did well academically. 1. However, Welch often got in trouble in school for impromptu singing and for singing too loudly in the school's choir. 1. Despite an early love of reading and literature, she was also diagnosed with mild dyslexia due to problems with spelling, alongside dyspraxia, a developmental coordination disorder that does not affect her reading ability, but caused issues with organization. 2021, music and books gave her a reprieve from what she felt made her different from others. I used reading as a form of escape. I was shy and sensitive, and so reading gave me a safe space. 22. Upon leaving secondary school and just bumming around Camberwell where I lived, working at a bar and thought that I should start doing something with life, Welch studied at Camberwell College of Arts before dropping out to focus on her music. 1. Initially, she had intended to take a year out from her studies to see where the music would go and then it started going somewhere so, she, never went back. 23. Career 2006 to 2010, Florence and the Machine and Lungs. Florence and the Machine performing at the O2 ABC Glasgow during their Lungs tour. According to Welch, the band name Florence and the Machine had started off as a private joke that got out of hand. I made music with my friend, who we called Isabella Machine, to which I was Florence Robot. When I was about an hour away from my first gig, I still didn't have a name. So I thought okay, I'll be Florence Robot, Isa Machine, before realizing that name was so long it'd drive me mad. 124, in 2006, Welch's performances with Isabella Summers in small London venues under the joint name Florence Robot, Isa Machine 25, began to attract notice. Citation needed, in 2007, Welch recorded with a band named Ashok. Who released an album titled Plans on the Filthy Lucre, about records label. This album included the earliest version of her later hit Kiss with a Fist, which at this point was titled Happy Slap. 26. Florence and the Machine released their debut album Lungs in the United Kingdom on July 6, 2009. The album was officially launched with a set at the Rivoli Ballroom in Brockley, southeast London. It peaked at number one in the UK and number two in Ireland. As of August 6, 2009, the album had sold over 100,000 copies in the UK and by 10th of August it had been at number two for five consecutive weeks. 27-28, following its July 25, 2009 release for download in the United States, the album debuted at number 17 on the Billboard Heatseekers Albums chart. 29, ultimately peaking at number 1. 30, the album was released physically in the U.S. on 20th of October by Universal Republic. 31, the album was produced by James Ford, Paul Epworth, Steve Mackey, and Charlie Hugall. 32, Welch contributed vocals to David Byrne and Fatboy Slim's 2010 album Here Lies Love, an album about Imelda Marcos. 33, as of January 2011, Welch was working with Drake on material slated for his upcoming album. 34. On February 27, 2011, Welch replaced Pregnant Dido and sang her portion of Best Original Song nominee If I Rise, from 127 Hours, with A.R. Rahman at the 83rd Academy Awards. 35-36. 12 Ceremonials and Solo Endeavors Florence and the Machine Concert at the Berkeley Greek Theatre on June 12, 2011 Welch singing at the Berkeley Greek Theatre on the Lungs Tour, 2011 The band's second album, Ceremonials, was released on October 31, 2011. In the album, Florence's obsession with drowning is represented through the use of repeated water imagery. 
37, it debuted at number 1 on the UK Albums Chart and number 6 on the US Billboard 200. 38 39, on January 12, 2012, Florence and the Machine were nominated for two Brit Awards, with the awards ceremony taking place on February 21, 2012 at the O2 Arena, London. 40, on April 26, 2012, the band released Breath of Life, a song which was recorded as the official theme song for the film Snow White and the Huntsman. 41 42, on July 5, 2012, a remix of Spectrum by Scottish musician Calvin Harris was released as the fourth single from Ceremonials, becoming the band's first UK number one hit. 43. Welch expressed excitement about putting new material together for a third album once the band finished touring at the end of September 2012. 44. Welch led a tribute to Amy Winehouse by performing Winehouse's song Back to Black and the Annie Lennox classic Walking on Broken Glass during the VH1 Divas Celebrates Soul concert held in December 2011. 45-46, the group performed in Times Square on December 31, 2011 for the 40th annual Dick Clark's New Year's Rockin' Eve special. 47. In October 2012, she was featured on Scottish singer-songwriter and producer Calvin Harris' song Sweet Nothing, which debuted at number one on the UK singles chart, marking Welch's second number one. 48. The song was taken from Harris' third studio album 18 Months and is the fifth single from the album. Sweet Nothing also peaked at number one in Ireland and number two in Australia and New Zealand. Sweet Nothing was certified platinum in Australia. Sweet Nothing received a nomination for Best Dance Recording at the 56th Annual Grammy Awards. 49. On November 29, 2012 Florence joined the Rolling Stones at the O2 Arena in London to sing Gimme Shelter. Her performance with Mick Jagger was described as sexy and electrifying. Citation needed. 2015-21, Collaborations. In February 2015, Florence and the Machine announced their third album, How Big, How Blue, How Beautiful, which was released on June 1, 2015. The album reached number one in many markets including the US, the UK, Australia, and Canada. The record spawned two top 40 UK hits, and earned three Grammy nominations. 50. During June 2015, Dave the Grawl of the Foo Fighters broke his leg on stage prior to his band's upcoming Glastonbury Festival headline performance, causing Florence and the Machine to be the headline band. They headlined the festival for the first time on June 26, 2015. 51. In September 2016, during an interview with Heat Radio, American singer Lady Gaga revealed that she and Florence had recorded a song together. The track, titled Hey Girl, was later featured on Gaga's fifth album Joanne. 52, footage of their studio session was featured in Gaga's Netflix documentary Gaga, 5 Foot 2. In March 2017, Welch appeared in Song to Song directed by Terence Malick. 53. In May 2017, Welch contributed a song titled To Be Human to the Wonder Woman soundtrack co-written with Rick Nowles. The song is performed on the film's soundtrack by Sia and Labyrinth. Welch performing at Key Arena in Seattle during the High As Hope Tour, 2018. On April 12, 2018, Florence and the Machine released a song titled A Sky Full of Song and an accompanying music video on YouTube, directed by A.G. Rojas. The song was released for Record Store Day on April 21, which supports brick and mortar record stores. A limited edition 7 inches vinyl was also released. 54. Also in 2018, Hunger was released. Florence and the Machine's fourth studio album, High as Hope, was released on June 29, 2018. 55. On May 22, 2018, Florence Welch performed a duet with Mick Jagger, at London Stadium, during the Rolling Stones No Filter Tour. They sang Wild Horses. In July 2018, Welch published her first book Useless Magic, Lyrics and Poetry. 
The book showcases her lyrics and poetry, alongside corresponding artwork from the time of her first album Lungs to her 2018 release High as Hope. 56. On April 28, 2021, Welch announced that she would contribute music and lyrics to a musical adaptation of F. Scott Fitzgerald's The Great Gatsby, with producer Thomas Bartlett co-writing the adaptation's music and Martin Imagic writing the book and Rebecca Fricknell directing. 57. 2022 Present, Dance Fever In January 2022 it was confirmed that the band would be headlining a few summer festivals which lead to many theorizing that Welch's fifth studio album could possibly be released during the first semester of 2022. By the end of February, some selected fans started receiving medieval-styled tarot cards. The cards had the words King and Florence and the Machine, Chapter 1 written on them. On February 23, 2022, Welch released a single. King, and an accompanying music video, directed by Autumn De Wild. On March 7, 2022, the second single was released alongside a music video, also directed by Autumn De Wild, titled Heaven Is Here. On March 9, 2022 Florence announced through her Instagram page that the band's fifth album would be titled Dance Fever and would have 14 songs, in her words a fairy tale and 14 songs. On March 10, 2022, the third single was released called My Love which also featured a music video directed by Autumn De Wilde. The single premiered on BBC's Radio 1 morning show Breakfast with Greg James where Florence was the special guest and announced the release date of their upcoming album Dance Fever, May 13, 2022. Artistry Kate Bush performing Tori Amos performing Welch's vocal styling has been compared to those of Kate Bush, left, and Tori Amos, right. Welch has been compared to other singers such as Kate Bush, 58-59, Stevie Nicks, 60, Susie Sue, 5859, PJ Harvey, 58, Shirley Manson, 61, Allison Goldfrapp, 62, Tori Amos, 63, and Bjork, 59. When describing lungs, Welch said, When I was writing these songs, I used to refer to myself as Florence Robot... Dot 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 because I really like what a machine thinks organic instruments really sound like. 34. Welch possesses a contralto vocal range. 64. Influences. During interviews, Welch has cited singers Grace Slick, Alanis Morissette, and Stevie Nicks as influences and heroes. 6566, she told Rolling Stone in 2010, I'm pretty obsessed with Stevie Nicks, from her style to her voice. I like watching her on YouTube and her old performances, the way she moves and everything. 67. She has also listed in her early influences the likes of John Cale, Otis Redding, Susie Sue, David Byrne, and Lou Reed. 68. In a review of ceremonials, Jody Rosen of Rolling Stone described Florence and the Machine's style as dark, robust and romantic, deeming the ballad only of For a Night as a mix of classic soul and Midnight on the Moors English art rock. 58. Welch stated that her lyrics related to Renaissance artists, were dealing with all of the same things they did, love and death, time and pain, heaven and hell. 69. Welch has used religious imagery in her music and performances, though she has stated, I'm not a religious person. Sex, violence, love, death, are the topics that I'm constantly wrestling with, it's all connected back to religion. 70. Nick Welch, her father, contributed a rock and roll element to the family mix, in his 20s. He lived in a West End squat and attended the Squatters Ball organized by Heathcote Williams where the 101ers played regularly. 71. A self-confessed frustrated performer, if Nick, as he put it, nudged Flo in any way, it's only been to listen to the Ramones rather than Green Day. 71. Evelyn, Welch's mother, had an equally strong, yet completely different influence on her daughter. A visit to one of her mother's Renaissance lectures left teenage Florence deeply impressed. She explained, 
I aspire to something like that, but with music. I hope that my music has some of the big themes, sex, death, love, violence, that will still be part of the human story in 200 years' time. 71. Image Welch is known for her distinctive clothing style, often performing concerts wearing light Gucci dresses, barefoot and without jewelry. 72. Vogue described her style as bohemian and called her the queen of bohemian style. 73. When discussing her fashion style, Welch said that, for the stage, it's the Lady of Shalott meets Ophelia dot 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 mixed with scary gothic bat lady. But in real life I'm kind of prim. 74. Welch often mixes artistic influences both in her fashion style and music with a strong nod towards the style of the Pre-Raphaelite Brotherhood. 75, 2011 saw Gucci dressing her for her summer tour and a performance at the Chanel Rondway show at Paris Fashion Week. 76, Welch describes 1970s American drag queen troupe The Coquettes and French chanson singer François Hardy as fashion mentors. 77. Welch has also named Fleetwood Mac member Stevie Nicks as a musical, fashion and general influence. 78. Welch can sometimes be seen in concert paying homage to Nicks famous billowing stage dress. Citation needed. Welch has spoken about being a fantasist as a child, stating, I was, constantly reading books, thinking, I'm not a mermaid. I can't breathe underwater. I can't fly. One of the saddest and most heartbreaking things is that I remember really wanting to be able to magically change my appearance, 79, and stated that this impacted her image and sound. 80, her style and mannerisms have led fans and the media comparing her to a witch, 8182, a mermaid, 8384, and a fairy, 8586. Personal Life Welch considers herself an introvert and is passionate about reading and literature. She has held many events with her fan-run book club, between two books. It's a huge generalization to say that all readers are introverts, I'm sure there's a lot of extroverted bookworms out there, but, for me, it's nice to know people of similar inclinations can actually come together in a social way and talk about something that is inherently solitary. 87. Although many of her songs contain Christian themes and elements, Welch has said she does not follow any particular religion. I went to Catholic school, and the first songs I remember liking were hymns. I find it's nice to mix the mundane and the magical, the irrelevant with the huge themes. Sex, love, death, marriage, guilt, mix that with seeing a huge sky or going for a walk or turning the page of a book. Living is dealing with the everyday and the notion that you're going to die. 88. Welch has been open about her struggles with anxiety and depression, as well as with alcohol. Many of her songs reflect these issues. 89. In 2019, she discussed her panic attacks with Sinead Burke. She explained, My hands go tingly, my lips go tingly. I sort of think that it's very serious and I'm about to die and I have to lie on the floor and breathe. I know I'm having a panic attack, really. But I also really want someone to take me to hospital. 90. In 2015, Welch broke her foot after leaping off the stage at the Coachella Festival. 91. She revealed that she used to drink alcohol before every performance, telling Billboard, I'm quite shy, really. That's probably why I used to drink a lot. But I don't anymore. When I finally took time off to make this new record, I had time to strengthen. And when I was coming back into the fray, I really didn't want to lose that. I thought I could go dive bomb back into it, but look what happened. I dived into it and literally broke myself. 15. Political Views In 2016, Welch voiced her support for Remain during the United Kingdom's EU membership referendum. 92. Welch is also a vocal advocate for LGBT rights, and regularly waves the rainbow flag at her concerts, particularly during her song Spectrum, Say My Name. 93-94. In 2018, 
she tweeted her support for the removal of the Eighth Amendment of the Constitution of Ireland. 95. The removal passed and legalized abortion access within the country. In 2019, Welch expressed her support for women's rights during concerts in Las Vegas, Nevada, Chicago, Illinois, Raleigh, and Columbia, Maryland. She encouraged her audience to donate to the ACLU instead of buying concert merchandise. 96. In March 2022, Florence expressed her support for Ukraine during the Russian-Ukrainian War. The Florence and the Machine video for Heaven is Here was recently filmed in Kiev, the capital of Ukraine. Florence wrote on her Twitter, Two of the dancers in this video are currently sheltering. To my brave and beautiful sisters Mirine and Anastasia. I love you. I wish I could put my arms around you. Strength. She also shared an article about the ways to help Ukraine. 9798. Discography. Main article, Florence and the Machine Discography. Lungs, 2009. Ceremonials, 2011. How Big, How Blue, How Beautiful, 2015. High as Hope, 2018. Dance Fever, 2022. As Featured Artist. Single Year Peak Chart Position Certifications Album. UK. 99, O's. 100, Ought. 101, Can. 102, Jer. 103, Ir. 104, NZ. 105, Nor. 106, SWI. 107, US. 108. Sweet Nothing. Calvin Harris featuring. Florence Welch. 2012 1 2 29 15 19 1 2 13 36 10 BPI Platinum 109 Aria 3 times Platinum 110 BVMI Gold 111 MC 2 times Platinum 112 RIAA 2 times Platinum 113 Ryans Platinum 114 18 months. Wild season. Banks and Steels featuring. Florence Welch, 2017-A, Anything But Words. Notes. Wild season did not enter the UK singles chart, but peaked at number 74 on the UK physical singles chart. 115. Album appearances. Title year album. Riverside. Kid Harpoon and Florence Welch, backing vocals, 2008 The second EP. She's No Sense. The Big Pink and Florence Welch, backing vocals, 2009 Dominoes. Here Lies Love. David Byrne and Fatboy Slim featuring Florence Welch, 2010 Here Lies Love. My Baby Just Cares For Me, from The Hootenanny 2009. Jules Holland and Florence Welch, 2012 The Golden Age of Song I Come Apart ASAP Rocky featuring Florence Welch, 2013 Long, Live ASAP Neon City Z Felix White featuring Florence Welch, Background Vocals, Cosmo Yala Felix White featuring Florence Welch, Background Vocals Swarm Felix White featuring Florence Welch, background vocals. Midnight. Felix White featuring Florence Welch. The Other Side. Emil Haney featuring Florence Welch, backing vocals, 2015 We Fall. Win in Disgrace with Fortune and Men's Eyes, Sonnet 29. Rufus Wainwright featuring Florence Welch and Ben DeVries, 2016 Take All My Loves. Nine Shakespeare Sonnets Hey Girl Lady Gaga featuring Florence Welch, Joanne Wild Horses, Live The Rolling Stones featuring Florence Welch, 2019 Hong Deluxe Edition Cheating on a Stranger Adam Green and Florence Welch, Backing Vocals, Engine of Paradise Songwriting Credits
Year Artist Album Song Co-Written With 2016 Rihanna Andy Goodnight Gotham Robin Fenty, Paul Epworth 2017 See a Wonder Woman OST to be Human featuring Labyrinth Richard Nowles Jr. 2020 Camel Fat Dark Matter Easier featuring Lowe's David Whelan, Michael D. Scala, Justin Parker Filmography 2017 Song to Song 2020 The Third Day, Miniseries Awards and Nominations See also List of awards and nominations received by Florence and the Machine. This section needs additional citations for verification. Please help improve this article by adding citations to reliable sources. Unsourced material may be challenged and removed. May 2018, learn how and when to remove this template message. Year Category Category Nominated Work Result 2009 Brit Awards Critics' Choice Award 116, Florence Welch won. 2010 Enemy Awards Best Dressed Florence Welch nominated. 2011 Virgin Media Music Awards Best Live Act nominated. Shameless Publicity Seeker nominated. 2012 MP3 Music Awards The HDT Awards Sweet Nothing, featuring Calvin Harris, nominated. 2013 British Fashion Awards Best British Style Florence Welch nominated. Enemy Awards Dance Floor Anthem 117, Sweet Nothing, featuring Calvin Harris, won. MTV Video Music Awards Japan Best Collaboration nominated. MTV Video Music Awards Best Editing nominated. Billboard Music Awards Top EDM Song nominated. 2014 Grammy Awards Best Dance Recording 118, nominated. iHeartRadio Music Awards EDM Song of the Year nominated. World Music Awards World's Best Song nominated. World's Best Video nominated. World's Best Female Artist Florence Welch nominated. World's Best Live Act nominated. 2016 Grammy Awards Best Rock Song 119. What Kind of Man nominated Silver Clef Awards Best Female 120, Florence Welch won 2017 Ivor Novello Awards International Achievement 121, won 2018 Mercury Prize Album of the Year 122, High as Hope nominated References Patterson, Sylvia, September 20, 2009 Behind the Success of Florence and the Machine. The Sunday Times. London. Archived from the original on June 15, 2011. Retrieved March 7, 2010. Alt URL. Florence and the Machine Open Reading Festival with Secret Birthday Gig. NME. August 28, 2009. Archived from the original on August 31, 2009. Retrieved June 18, 2011. Florence Welch. Glamour. Archived from the original on July 19, 2021. Retrieved June 18, 2011. Ryan, Francesca, June 4, 2009. Florence and the Machine Interview, Sound and Vision. The Telegraph. Archived from the original on January 12, 2022. Interview with Evelyn Welch. Association of Art Historians. Archived from the original on March 5, 2016. James Welch to wed Evelyn Samuels. The New York Times. New York City. August 8, 1982. Retrieved October 6, 2015. Professor Evelyn Welch FKC. King's College London. Retrieved July 4, 2018. Varga, George. Florence Welch on Music, Maturing and Not Drinking. San Diego Union Tribune. Retrieved July 13, 2018. West, Richard, January 29, 1997. Obituary, Colin Welch. The Independent. Sellers, John, November 21, 2011. Florence Welch on Her Fear of Treadmills, Lady Gaga, and Ceremonials. Spin. Retrieved October 6, 2015. 
Florence Welch opens up about regrets over her relationship with her sister. NME. July 3, 2018. Retrieved June 7, 2022. Instagram, Florence Welch. Florence's Instagram. Instagram. Archived from the original on December 26, 2021. Retrieved November 19, 2018. Patterson, Sylvia, September 20, 2009. Behind the Success of Florence and the Machine. The Sunday Times. Archived from the original on February 1, 2014. Subscription required. Corner, Lewis, May 23, 2011. Florence Welch, New Songs About My Dead Grandma. Digital Spy. 15 Things You Probably Didn't Know About Florence Welch. Fuse. Retrieved February 27, 2018. Memorial Service, The Times, page 24, May 16, 1997. Taysom, Joe, June 25, 2018. Florence Welch talks about alcohol and her grandmother's suicide. Far Out Magazine. Far Out Magazine. Retrieved November 19, 2018. Wise Man, Eva, June 24, 2018. Florence Welch, I wonder sometimes, did I dream too big? The Guardian. Retrieved December 1, 2018. Prince George arrives for first day of school with Prince William. September 7, 2017. Florence Welch, quirky mind behind machine. Dyspraxia USA. Dyspraxia USA. Retrieved June 28, 2018. Simulus, Linda. Why Florence is a star, not a machine. Daily Telegraph. Daily Telegraph. Retrieved June 28, 2018. Petrarca, Amelia. Welch, book club enthusiast, gets candid about the literature that changed her. W Magazine. W Magazine. Retrieved June 28, 2018. May, Hannah, December 14, 2009. Florence and the Machine. Hardy Magazine. Archived from the original on January 6, 2010. Retrieved January 20, 2014. Bell, Sean, July 26, 2009. A Piece of My Mind, Florence Welch of Florence and the Machine. The Herald. Herald and Times Group. Retrieved March 6, 2010. Florence and the Machine. Discogs. Retrieved May 7, 2020. Parkin, April, April 4, 2007. Ashok Dash Plans, Filthy Lucre. Gigwise. Giant Digital. Retrieved January 30, 2011. Interview, Florence and the Machine. Yorkshire Evening Post. Yorkshire Post Newspapers. August 6, 2009. Archived from the original on January 14, 2013. Retrieved August 8, 2009. Sexton, Paul, August 10, 2009. Michael Jackson extends UK album chart run, Tenchi Strider notches second top single. Billboard. Retrieved August 10, 2009. Heatseekers albums. Week of July 25, 2009. Billboard. Retrieved June 14, 2011. Florence and the Machine Album and Song Chart History, Heat Seekers Albums. Billboard. Retrieved June 14, 2011. Tardinella, Emily, July 7, 2009. Florence and the Machine, Lungs. Pop Matters. Retrieved July 12, 2009. Ray, Benedict, November 16, 2009. Florence and the Machine, The Voice That Bewitched Pop. Archived from the original on February 9, 2010. Retrieved November 17, 2009. Brown, Helen, April 1, 2010. Here Lies Love, David Byrne and Fatboy Slim, CD Review. The Daily Telegraph. London. Archived from the original on January 12, 2022. Retrieved April 8, 2010. Perpetua, Matthew, January 13, 2011. Drake to collaborate with the 20th and Florence and the Machine. Rolling Stone. Retrieved January 17, 2011. 
Semigran, Alley, February 28, 2011. Florence and the Machine drew on emotional 127 hours at Oscars. MTV News. Viacom. Retrieved March 7, 2011. Via Hair, Renuka, February 13, 2011. Why Dido Won't Perform with Raman at Oscars. The Times of India. Retrieved March 7, 2011. Morrison, Chrissy. The Exorcism of Florence Welch. Enemy New Musical Express, 2011, pages 18 to 22. Florence and the Machine album takes number one. BBC News. November 7, 2011. Retrieved December 4, 2011. Caulfield, Keith, November 9, 2011. Justin Bieber's Mistletoe Brighton's Billboard 200 with number one debut. Billboard. Retrieved March 17, 2012. Brit Awards 2012, nominations in full. The Guardian. January 12, 2012. Retrieved February 5, 2012. Florence and the Machine debut new song Breath of Life. NME. April 26, 2012. Retrieved April 28, 2012. Bell, Crystal, April 26, 2012. Florence and the Machine, Breath of Life, singer releases new Snow White and the Huntsman track, audio. Huffington Post. Retrieved April 28, 2012. Florence and the Machine score first ever number one with a little help from Calvin Harris. Official Charts Company. Retrieved May 7, 2020. Florence Welch, My Live Shows Are Like an Exorcism. NME. July 31, 2012. Retrieved August 17, 2012. VH1 Divas, Florence Welch leads Amy Winehouse tribute. Billboard. December 20, 2011. Retrieved March 18, 2012. Back to Black by Florence and the Machine. VH1.com. December 19, 2011. Archived from the original on October 7, 2015. Retrieved October 6, 2015. Kaufman, Gill, December 7, 2011. Nicki Minaj, LMFAO Join Dick Clark's New Year's Rockin' Eve. MTV News. Retrieved March 18, 2012. Calvin Harris and Florence Welch's Sweet Nothing debuts at UK No. 1. Press Party. October 21, 2012. Retrieved October 6, 2015. The National Academy of Recording Arts and Sciences Incorporated, Final Nominations List, 56th Grammy Awards, PDF. www.grammy.com. Archived from the original, PDF, on July 1, 2015. Retrieved June 26, 2015. Florence and the Machine. Grammy.com. May 22, 2018. Retrieved October 21, 2018. Youngs, Ian, June 26, 2015. Glastonbury, Florence and the Machine Step Up with Headline Set. BBC News Online. Retrieved June 26, 2015. P8 World, September 9, 2016. Lady Gaga, I'm a very simple person, though I might appear complicated. Archived from the original on December 15, 2021. Retrieved May 21, 2019, via YouTube. Phillips, Amy, March 7, 2017. Licky, Patty, Iggy, and more, every musician in Terence Malick's Song to Song. Pitchfork. Retrieved March 8, 2017. Twitter. Mobile.twitter.com. Retrieved April 13, 2018. Stavropoulos, Laura, June 28, 2019. High as Hope, How Florence and the Machines Spread Their Gospel. You Discover Music. Retrieved March 19, 2020. I never thought I would talk about it. So Florence Welch put it in a song. The New York Times. June 14, 2018. Retrieved August 13, 2018. Lang, Brent, April 28, 2021. Florence Welch writing Great Gatsby Musical. Variety.
Retrieved April 28, 2021. Rosen, Jody, November 15, 2011. Ceremonials. Rolling Stone. Retrieved November 1, 2011. Garrett, Cheryl, June 14, 2009. Pop Review, Florence and the Machine, Lungs. The Guardian. Retrieved November 15, 2011. Gregoria Diz, Vanessa, November 25, 2011. How the arty, ethereal singer became the Stevie Nicks of the Twilight Generation. Rolling Stone. Retrieved November 19, 2018. Top influential music style icons. Glamour. Retrieved September 4, 2014. Why We Love Alison Goldfrapp. Get Music. Archived from the original on October 20, 2014. Retrieved October 6, 2015. Florence and the Machine, Cornflake Girl, Tori Amos Cover. Spin. September 19, 2018. Retrieved May 23, 2022. Welch's voice has been compared to Tori Amos pretty much since she came onto the scene. G. Catherine. July 3, 2016. Florence and the Machine and Kendrick Lamar, British Summertime, Review, Hippie Euphoria Meets Lyrical Hip Hop. The Daily Telegraph. Retrieved April 1, 2018. Florence Welch, My London. Evening Standard. July 30, 2009. Retrieved March 17, 2012. Welch, Florence, 2014. Florence and the Machine Interview. MSN Music, Interview. Interviewed by Matt Sichter. Toronto. Archived from the original on December 15, 2021, via YouTube. Read, Ryan, July 11, 2018. Here Florence and the Machine cover Silver Springs. Rolling Stone. Retrieved November 19, 2018. Glass, Joshua, November 30, 2016. John Cale Muses on Poetry, Sobriety, and Hood by Air with Florence Welch. DocumentJournal.com. Archived from the original on December 5, 2016. Retrieved November 30, 2016. Visionary Vixen. Los Angeles Times Magazine. January 3, 2011. Archived from the original on September 11, 2011. Retrieved March 11, 2013. Florence and the Machine, I Love Demons and Exorcism. NME. July 4, 2011. Retrieved November 18, 2013. Odell, Mike, May 2010. Florence Attacks. Q number 286. Pages 46 to 52. Florence Welch's Ceremonial Gucci Stage Dress. Vogue Paris, in French. August 13, 2018. Retrieved February 13, 2019. Florence Welch proves she's still the queen of bohemian style. Vogue. August 12, 2018. Retrieved February 13, 2019. Marcus, Laura, August 9, 2010. Style Idol, Florence Welch. Venus Zine. Archived from the original on April 1, 2012. Retrieved September 23, 2010. Florence Welch, perfect model for the Pre-Raphaelite Brotherhood. Daily Art Magazine. April 25, 2020. Ellison, Jesse, October 23, 2011. Florence's Dark Side of Fame. The Daily Beast. Retrieved March 18, 2012. Florence Welch's fashion, it's not inner turmoil. It's total escapism Billboard October 4, 2011. Billboard. October 5, 2011. Retrieved November 21, 2011. Edgar, Michelle, September 6, 2010. Behind the Scenes with Florence and the Machine, Music Unites Interviews. Huffington Post. Archived from the original on October 6, 2016. Retrieved June 30, 2018. Craig, Laura, June 20, 2019. Florence Welch is changing things up. Evening Standard. Retrieved July 28, 2021. Musicnews.com, September 28, 2012. 
Mermaid fantasies feature in Florence Welch's songs. Noise11.com Florence is glad that her track's lyrics echo her childhood ideals. I kind of had these fantasies of Atlantis and of mermaids, and this idea that underwater, that's where everything must be, she told the Sun Sentinel. I was a slightly uncomfortable child and to be underwater was to be graceful and to be submerged in something that was neither good nor bad. It just kind of takes you under, away from something. Mark Antonio, Isabella, October 28, 2019. Witchy Women. Expose Online. Florence Welch has big cosmic witch energy. Astrology, astronomy, and celestial yearnings all bleed into her repertoire. Gregoria Diaz, Vanessa, November 25, 2011. Florence Welch, The Good Witch. Rolling Stone. McCall, Tyler. Great Outfits in Fashion History, Florence Welch as a Chanel Mermaid. Fashionista. Mac, Emmy, October 21, 2015. Florence Welch is a heavenly water angel in her ship to wreck performance on Ellen. Music Feeds. Anderson. Kristen, April 14, 2016. Florence Welch is our kind of, Gucci-wearing, fairy tale princess. Vogue. Ferdisa, she, her, on Twitter, Florence Welch in Gucci looking like a. Archive.ph. July 28, 2021. Archived from the original on July 28, 2021. Petrarca, Amelia. Florence Welch. Book Club Enthusiast, Gets Candid About Literature. W. Retrieved July 13, 2018. Gunderson, Edna. July 31, 2011. Florence Plus High Profile. USA Today. Retrieved July 13, 2018. Florence Welch Reveals Struggle with Alcoholism, Depression. 105.7 The Point. Retrieved December 1, 2018. As Me with Sinead, 11, Florence Welch, Lemonada Media. Lemonadamedia.com. Retrieved June 7, 2022. Battersby, Matilda, April 15, 2015. Florence Welch breaks foot leaping off stage at Coachella. The Independent. London. Retrieved July 27, 2015. The Celebrities That Support Brexit, and the Ones Backing Remain. The Independent. Retrieved November 27, 2018. Stern, Bradley. Florence Welch holds rainbow flag, leads Love is Love chant in concert. Pop Crush. Retrieved February 18, 2019. Rini, Jen. Firefly Recap, A Weekend of Love, Awareness, and Music. USA Today. Retrieved February 18, 2019. Irish Abortion Referendum, Musicians Encourage Votes, Tweets. Billboard. May 25, 2018. Retrieved May 18, 2019. At Florence at Machine Braun Instagram, Florence and the Machine, Las Vegas, May 17, 2019. Legend written by at Florence at Machine Braun.